Um, I can't get on the internet to update AVG because the host file is screwed up and I don't have time to fix it. So what I'm going to do is just update from a directory. AVG allows you to update um, from a, you can download their update file. And it's detected the update that I just fed it. The 20 meg update. If I wanted to clean the host file, I would just use a brute force uh, program to delete the file, like File Assassin or Killbox, something like that. Okay, AVG is completely updated to October 22nd. And um, what I'm going to do is run a full scan with AVG. We're going to scan the whole computer. Uh, we're scanning with all the options turned on. And we have to go through this stupid little antivirus 2009 fake thing, so hold on, I'll pause it. Okay, that stupid thing's gone. Let's just go ahead and do a um, automatic scan. And the scan is starting. And of course, I'm not going to stay around for the whole scan. I'm going to go ahead and pause this. Um, so when I come back, we'll see the results. And we'll try to clean, you know, all the good regular stuff. Be back uh, in an instant for you guys. Okay, guys, I'm um, back after that scan. And it found 182 infections, cleaned 181 right off the bat, and it could not clean one of them. Found 36 spyware, cleaned 36 spyware, and it's asking me to reboot. So I'll go ahead and reboot. And I'll pause the video real quick. Uh, actually, I'll show you the whole re reboot process. Let's see how fast it starts up. Not too bad. See a black screen right now, just waiting.
hard drive is kind of chugging along. You can see it right down there. But I see nothing in the way of a desktop yet or anything like that. Trying to bring up Task Manager, but I guess that's not working right now. Okay, well, I guess I'll pause it and reboot. Okay, this time it actually started back up. And let's see what we got. Uh, I've got a fake system alert down there, so AVG didn't detect that. It won't shut up. If I click it, doesn't really do much. Uh, let me go ahead and test uh, Internet Explorer. Let me reset the page. search for uh, combo fix. Mm, I get redirected. Uh, this computer now has a new rootkit called uh, TDS serve, which I see every day now. So no matter what site I try to click on, I'll just be redirected go.google.com so um, AVG kinda completely fails on detecting any kind of rootkit stuff as far as I can tell I mean I've I tried it on a couple clients and it doesn't do anything rootkit wise I don't even know why they offer the protection um, because I th I'm pretty sure the free version actually scans for rootkits could be wrong. Hang on a second. Uh, let me start a new video. Hang on.